Hi right, guys, so if you want to see me making these lovely delicious lamb chop, you just continue to watch this video. Hi guys, so this is Jody cooking and today guys, I'm going to make you guys some oven lamb chop. This is the lamb chop that I'll be using. It's already washed. It's already clean. So these are all my seasoning guys. So you have all purpose seasoning. You have everyday seasoning. You have paprika. You have black pepper. You have garlic powder. You have ginger powder. And you also have chili seed. And I'm going to also use soya sauce, the dark one, and some ketchup also. And you're also going to need, guys, you're going to need onions, garlic, pimento seed, thyme, and rosemary. I've used the bottle rosemary. This is how it look. So I'm just going to add all my seasoning guys. So I'm using one spoonful of the all purpose seasoning. And one spoonful of the everyday seasoning. One teaspoonful of the ginger powder. And one teaspoonful of the paprika this is the chili seed around a teaspoonful that's the black pepper and the garlic powder one teaspoonful and I'm gonna also add my soya sauce Around three spoonful. And I'm gonna also add my ketchup. Around two to three spoonful. So what I'm gonna do now guys, I'm just gonna pour all my herbs on my meat. And I'm going to add some vegetable oil just for it to be moist because I'm going to leave it in the fridge to marinate. So first thing I'm going to do guys, I'm just going to take my hand and just massage the meat as I always do. Just make sure all the meat is all covered in the seasoning. So my lamb chop is all seasoning and this is how it look guys. So what I'm going to do guys, I'm going to leave it in the fridge for at least 6 hours to marinate. Hi guys, so my lamb chop is finally marinate. So this is how it look. Here I have a tray right here guys. So first thing I'm going to do, I'm just going to grease my tray with some coconut oil. Then I'm just going to take my lamb chop and just put it in the tray. So all my lamb chop is in the tray guys. So what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna pour some vegetable oil all over it. Then I'm gonna put some fresh thyme on top of it. Then I'm going to add also all my onions and my garlic from the lamb chop 
and that juice that leave back so I'm just gonna pour it all over so this is how it look guys it look amazing already so what I'm gonna do guys I'm gonna put it in the oven and 150 degree and I'm gonna check back on it in half an hour time hi guys so I just take my lamb chop from the oven and this is how it look guys i'm telling you it smells so nice if you guys was in my house right now that smell is just amazing so what i'm gonna do guys i'm just gonna turn them So this is how it look guys after I turn it. So what I'm going to do guys, I'm going to put it back in the oven on 150 degree for half an hour. And that gravy that's there guys, I won't throw it away. I'm going to make my own gravy with it. So that's my gravy there guys, that left back from the lamb chop. This is how it look. So here I have a bowl here guys with some plain flour is one spoonful because I'm gonna use it for my gravy so what I'm gonna do guys I'm just gonna add some water to it cold water just gonna mix it around so this is how it should look guys after you finish mix it just make sure it's not lumpy, it's all smooth. So what I'm going to do now guys, I'm just going to pour my mix in my gravy. Continue to stir it, guys. Make sure you put your stove on medium, okay? So I'm just gonna taste it, guys, to see if it needs any salt. I'm just gonna add some salt to it, guys, because it tastes a bit fresh. I run a teaspoon of salt. Then, then I'm also gonna add some soy sauce to it, just for color. So I'm just gonna leave it to simmer, guys, for at least fifteen minutes. Hi guys, so I also had a bit of rosemary to my gravy and black pepper and all-purpose seasoning. Not a lot, just a tiny bit. So I'm just going to stir it. Because I want it to full of flavor, you know. So that's why I had it. And I also add a, a bit of garlic powder also. So my gravy is all finished now guys. And this is how it look. Hi guys. So my lamb chop is finally finished. And this is how it look guys. What I'm going to do now guys. I'm going to plate it up for you guys. And show you guys how it look on the plate. Hi guys, so this is how my lamb chop looks on the plate. I'm having it with rice and peas, salad, broccoli and carrot and tomato. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you do, please like and subscribe for many other videos. I thank you all so much for watching. Until next time, bye!